Mr. Daniels? Yes. You're so, that's so formal. I'm just a guy named Chris. <laughs> just, just the way we were raised. That's Sherry with a difficult to pronounce last name. Nicolopoulos. Everyone knows me as Nick. Okay. AKA Nick for Nick's Barbershop. She's at ease tonight, talking about a painful past 42 days with how social distancing mandates force the closure of her Muckleteo shop. And as a sole proprietor, it gave her no prospects to collect unemployment. Mr. Daniels, it's tough. We're a small business and I am a people person. My job as a people person, I'm a people person. I love to hug. I love to be social and talk with people. And, you know, when you're cutting hair, it is a touchy job. And it's been really hard because it's my only source of income. That changes tonight. Eligibility will open up for a whole new number of individuals who don't typically qualify for traditional unemployment insurance. Nick Damaris with Washington's Employment Security Department says the Federal CARES Act is now allowing for payments to people who classify as independent contractors. The state's website was offline for most of the day to prepare for a wave of requests tonight. The tsunami of new applications. We anticipate that we are going to you know, have hundreds of thousands of Washingtonians be able to access these benefits. In addition, the department has hired hundreds of people for a call center to handle requests. We're sorry. We are experiencing an extremely high volume of calls. He acknowledges the system has been overwhelmed with 585,000 claims this past week. We've been looking at it every day, waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting. Nick says she was among the first in the digital line that she hopes leads to another path. Hopefully slowly get back to normal just to be able to open our doors and just to get back to some kind of normalcy. In Seattle, Chris Daniels, King 5 News.